Wolf. I mean, uh, I'm the head of the operations group there, and it's uh, right outside the control room. And if, uh, again, if all the information, I can tell you, I, I mean, exactly, it's about to, what, 45 feet away. We, we, did, we disconnected, if we disconnected the two slides from it disconnected the harmonic filters, so we put a LMR 900, and you can see me putting the LMR, in the article, you can see me put the LMR 900 right into the, into the, uh, the wave slide. I was about 40 feet away from the control room, and uh, we had, I had uh, people just, what, what, all I had to do was start tracking the moon, and then go, go, go back into, uh, into our, uh, our little station there, and start, uh, start picking up signals. So, I mean, when you, when you say how far away it is, uh, you say how far away, the, the, the control point from the, uh, from the operation center, but uh, from where we were, up to, up to the telescope, it's about 1,700 feet, guys. It has, it has been fun there, Dick, and uh, uh, a lot of the friends I invited are uh, very, uh, I guess, uh, I mean, uh, I guess people that we've known uh, for, for a while there, and uh, for example, uh, uh, Jim Brakel, my friend Dr. Jim Brakel, uh, WA3FET, he was designer for Many, many antennas, as a matter of fact, he's designed the antenna I'm using right now on this band. He designed the, uh, the Skyhawk. It's the uh, 10, element, uh, 10 Element 3 band Skyhawk, uh, originally from Venture, now sold by uh, DX Engineering. Uh, Jim designed that antenna, and uh, he's been a friend of mine since, since I started to work there. And um, uh, Joe Taylor, K1JZ, who... Um, who wrote the software, JT65, and also the Nobel Laureate. He won the Nobel Prize using the Atacibo Telescope, um, uh, proving Einstein's theory of uh, relativity uh, with a binary uh, pulsar system. So, as uh, these people, uh, you know, I was in the right place at the right time, the old uh, friend of uh, NP4A, another uh, a very good friend of mine from Puerto Rico, the P4G, and uh, a guy that uh, he does a lot of uh, moon, because I was not in the moon bounce um, uh, uh, theme of uh, amateur radio, but I had the uh, everybody wanted to do moon bounce from the observatory. So I invited, uh, obviously, uh, Joe Taylor, who uh, wrote the software. Uh, Jim was a very good friend of mine, and before a very good friend of mine, and uh, who has done moon bounce before, and also uh, uh, Angel uh, does P4G. So, uh, um, so it was a good time. Again, so try to look at the article. It's, again, it's in USC uh, 2010. August 2010, you might say, enjoy it. WAPW, we keep on the free radio. And if you can't find it, I'll just send you a copy, Dad.